Are you a multi-EV household wondering if you can have two electric vehicle chargers at home? Stick around as we unravel the key questions you need to answer before making that decision. The short answer to this question is yes, you can have more than one electric vehicle charger at home. But the more important question is, do you need two home EV chargers? In this video, we will cover the questions to answer before deciding whether or not to invest in more than one home EV charger. First up, the price tag. A home EV charger is a significant investment and having two means doubling that cost. On average, you're looking at over £2,000 for both chargers fully installed. There are ways to help cushion the cost, like the EV charge point grant or financing options, but the price of two EV chargers will likely outweigh the benefits. How much space do you have at home? Do you have more than one garage or off-street parking space? These factors are essential when deciding on your electric vehicle charger setup. If you have limited space, it's straightforward. Go with one charger. But even if you have enough space, it's wise to carefully evaluate and choose the location for any additional charges. This is because it might affect the appearance of your property. Charging both of your EVs using two home EV chargers may seem like a good plan, but there's a catch. In UK homes, single phase electricity is most common. If you connect two 7 kilowatt home EV chargers to one circuit, each EV charger will charge at approximately 3 kilowatts to 3.6 kilowatts. This is instead of the expected 7 kilowatts. This equal rate splitting only happens if your EV chargers have load balancing. Without this feature, the electricity distribution might be uneven. It could cause one EV to charge faster than the other. Charging at this lower rate significantly slows down the overall charging speed. This extends the time required for a full charge. You must upgrade to a three-phase electricity supply if you want both EV charging points to operate at full capacity. But this upgrade is often very costly and probably not worth the extra investment for most households. Instead, consider opting for a single EV charger and rotating between the electric cars when each one completes charging. This approach might not only save time, but also money. The main advantage of having multiple home EV chargers is convenience. With two available chargers, you can charge your electric vehicles whenever you want. You have the flexibility to charge on your own schedule without waiting in line at public charging points. However, consider your daily commute and how often you take long trips. Also, consider the range of your EV. Think about whether having more than one charger is useful. Multiple chargers may be worthwhile if everyone in your household has a long daily commute. Smaller batteries that require frequent charging also make multiple chargers worthwhile. On the other hand, if EVs are only occasionally used or have large batteries, sharing one charger may be a better option. Additionally, check if your workplace has EV charging. Charging there saves money as it's quite often free and you may be able to avoid having to buy another EV charger if charging at work is a viable option. Type 2 is the most common EV socket in the UK, but some EVs, like the Nissan Leaf Mark 1, use Type 1. If a household member has a Type 1 EV with a tethered Type 1 charger, and you have a Type 2 EV, you can't use their charger. You'll need two home EV chargers unless it's a socketed charger, in which case you can share it by purchasing a Type 2 to Type 1 charging cable. If you have two electric vehicles at your home, please check the socket type for each vehicle before deciding whether or not to invest in a second charger. However, it's worth noting that the standard socket type in the UK is Type 2, so unless your vehicle is an older model, it's likely to have a Type 2 socket. If you stick with one home EV charging point, you could always share, but if you are desperate for a charge and your charger is occupied, other ways exist to top up your EV. Utilise public charging infrastructure and use rapid charging stations when out and about. To make life easier, you could even search the ZapMap app to find your closest public chargers. If there are many public chargers near you, investing in a second charger may not be worth it. You can use public chargers when your home charger is occupied and you need to charge. Consider utilising a neighbour's charger as a viable option. Companies like CoCharger facilitate the sharing of chargers among neighbours. In case your own charger is occupied during emergencies, you can rent out your neighbour's charger. This is likely to be a more cost-effective solution compared to using public charge points.
You must buy two home chargers with a low balancing feature to charge two electric vehicles at the same time. The easy one is an excellent option as it allows you to daisy chain up to three electric vehicle chargers on your property per fuse. This unit load balances to ensure the power is split equally between your chargers. You can charge safely and securely at the same time. As mentioned before, if you have a single phase electricity supply, when you charge both EVs at the same time, they will each charge at around 3 kilowatts. This is approximately half of the available 7.4 kilowatts. Dual chargers are one charging unit with two connectors attached. These home EV chargers are less common than your standard single EV chargers. The upside to a dual charger is that typically they are slightly cheaper than investing in two separate home EV chargers. With that being said, you will still have the issue of decreased charging speeds if you choose a dual charger. Currently, we do not stock any dual chargers here at We Power Your Car, but please feel free to contact us if you're interested in one. We may still be able to help you out or at least point you in the right direction. The only way to do this is by upgrading your property's electricity supply to three phase. Also, invest in two 7kW home chargers with the load balancing feature. Upgrading to a three phase electricity supply is expensive and time consuming. Additionally, there's the added cost of two EV chargers. Upgrading to a three phase supply might not be for everyone, but it is a viable option for people with specific requirements. So, do you really need two EV chargers at home? While you can have two EV chargers at home, from our perspective, a household will rarely need more than one. But it comes down to your personal preference and your household's charging needs. If you're considering getting a home EV charger installed, whether it's one or two, give us a call or visit our website. Our team of industry experts are available seven days a week to provide free, unbiased advice. With engineers across the UK, we can install wherever you are, all with first class customer service. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please consider leaving it a like or subscribing to our channel.